Um, it's uh, I don't know, two forty-five here in London. Just just got up, woke up after having uh, another wonderful night. Um, the uh, I saw the apparition again. Came into the room. It was at the foot of my bed, as usual, staring at me. Um, it's only there for two, three seconds and disappears. But it feels like a bloody lifetime. And uh, I'm not one to really believe in all this, but it's it's really freaked me out. Um, I guess it started a few months ago, um, actually in February on Valentine's Day, and, and I was woken up. I felt like someone had was watching me, so I, got, I, I woke up and there was this um, like, a, like a like a like a big shadowy apparition in the room. It was just like a tall person with this hat on. <laughs> I mean, it sounds like a joke, but I couldn't focus, and by the time I focused, they they disappeared. I mean, I was. I froze. I was. I, was, I kind of. I mean, my my. I got chills going through my arms now. My 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 palms are sweaty just from talking about it. It's. it's uh, it was in my room, and I um. I, I just froze. I tried to call to my my fiance laying next to me in bed, but I. I, I couldn't. And then, uh, I guess. After that, it, it was uh, one, two times a week, same thing, same scenario. I, I wake up with this feeling that someone was watching me, and I, um, I guess, by the time I focused, it would disappear. And I got to the point I got brave enough to, to turn the TV on, and th th that would make it go away. And then I started sleeping with the TV on, and I think my my fiance thought I was going crazy. And I thought I was going crazy until until she saw it once herself. Um, I remember sleeping one night and uh, I heard someone call my name and and um, it was weird. I was, someone shook me and it was her and she said that she'd seen it. It was in the room. It was on this side of side of her bed and it was in the room and it was looking down at her. And when she looked up at it, it, it disappeared. I mean, she was I mean, she was hysterical. Uh, she was really shaken up and I mean, she wanted to move and we did, but it didn't stop. It. Uh, I think um, my heart, <laughs> my fucking heart's going a million miles an hour. I, th I think the worst, the worst was in August. Um, I'm gonna keep going. Uh, I woke up, same scenario. I woke up in the night, and this time it just felt, uh, it felt so ominous. It, it, it was there in the room, and, but it wouldn't go away this time. <sighs> and. I never felt that much fear in my life. I felt like every pore of my body was just just frozen, and but I managed to. I somehow managed to nudge uh, Kate, my fiance, and she rolled over and, and it disappeared. Um, it, it's indescribable. Anyway, I'm making this uh, document this today to. A, get it out of my system and talk about it, and also to see if anyone else out there has experienced this apparition, this shadowy thing with a with a hat.